Hi everyone, Emily from Clay Pit here again, and I'm gonna be leading story time for you today. Are you ready for story time? I see Iris is ready for story time. Fiona's ready for story time. George and Christine are ready for story time. Siobhan is ready for story time. Rakan is ready for story time. Azim is ready for story time. Ian, Marcus, and Linnell are ready for story time. Everybody's ready for story time. Let's sing the hello song. We clap and say hello. We clap and say hello. With our friends at story time, we clap and say hello. We wave and say hello. We wave and say hello. With our friends at story time, we wave and say hello. We stomp and say hello. We stomp and say hello. With our friends at story time, we stomp and say hello. Great job, everybody! This week, we're learning about camping. Can you say camping? Say camping. Good job. Can you say camping with an excited voice because you're so excited to go camping this weekend? Camping! Great job. Can you say camping with a happy voice because you have such happy memories of the last time you went camping? Camping. Camping. Good job. Can you say camping with a scared voice because you're camping right now and you think you heard an animal outside your tent and you don't know what it is? <gasps> camping, camping, good job. Let's pretend to go camping. The first thing you normally do when you go camping is you pitch your tent. Can you pretend to pitch a tent over your head? Just with your fingers. Go ahead, pitch a tent. Good job. After you pitch your tent, you're gonna need to secure your tent to the ground by hammering some stakes in to hold it down. Let's pretend like we have a hammer in our hand. Can you hold your hammer? And now you're gonna take your tent stake and put it in the ground and you're gonna bang it into the ground with a hammer. Can you pretend like you're hammering that stake into the ground? Hammer, hammer, hammer it nice and hard. Good job. After we secure our tent, we might want to gather some firewood. Can you go on a search for some firewood? We're going to look at the ground and find little sticks. When we gather these little sticks, they're called kindling and they're going to help us get a fire started. So pretend like you're picking up sticks and putting them in a bundle in your arm. Pick up all those sticks. Great job. Now, we're gonna put them in the fire. You're gonna hand the sticks over to an adult and they're gonna take them from you and they're gonna build a fire. Now, we have this big roaring fire. Can you pretend like there's a fire right in front of you? And now that we have a fire, we can cook some different foods on it. Can you pretend like you're holding a stick over your fire and roasting a marshmallow? Go ahead and pretend like you're holding a stick, just like this one, with a marshmallow on it, and you're gonna roast your marshmallow. When we roast marshmallows, we wanna make sure that we stand back from the fire because fires could hurt us, and we need to stay nice and far away. Now our marshmallow is done. It's ready to eat. Great job, everybody. Now, we're gonna sing a song about going camping. Let's practice the dance moves before we start singing. The first dance move that we're gonna do is we're gonna march in place. Can you march in place with me? Great job. The next dance move we're gonna do is we're gonna pitch a tent. Can you pitch a tent? You're just gonna put your fingers together over your head and make your arms like a little triangle. Good job. The next dance move we're gonna do is we're gonna gather firewood. 
Bend down and pretend like you're picking sticks up off the ground and gathering them in your arms. Great job. The last dance move that we're going to do is we're going to pretend like we're playing the guitar. Can you pretend like you're playing the guitar? Play the guitar. Great job, everybody. Okay, ready? Now we're going to sing the song. I'm going to say the words and you can do the dance moves with me. Ready? We're going to start by marching in place. A camping we will go, a camping we will go. Hi ho, along we go, a camping we will go. First we pitch the tent, first we pitch the tent. Hi ho, along we go, first we pitch the tent. We gather firewood, we gather firewood. Hey ho, along we go, we gather firewood. We sing a campfire song, we sing a campfire song. Hey ho, along we go, we sing a campfire song. Great job, everybody. Now we're gonna use the felt board. Can everybody sit down with me while I use the felt board? We're gonna do something a little bit different with the felt board today, and we're gonna be guessing what type of animal that we're hearing from our tent. Okay, ready? So I'm gonna make an animal sound, and then I want you to try to guess what it is. Okay, let's pretend like we're laying in our sleeping bag in our tent. I was laying in my sleeping bag. I couldn't go to sleep. I looked at my watch and I wanted to weep. I rolled to my left, I rolled to my right, but all I could hear were animal noises in the night. I heard a hoo, 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 hoo. What animal did I hear? Hoo, hoo. An owl. Did you say owl? Good job! I heard an owl. Can you make a hoo hoo sound like an owl? Hoo hoo. Great job! All right, let's pretend to go to sleep again. I was laying in my sleeping bag. I couldn't go to sleep. I looked at my watch and I wanted to weep. I rolled to my left, I rolled to my right, but all I could hear were animal noises in the night. I heard a Can you say coyote? Good job. Now, can you make a noise like a coyote? Oh! Great job. Okay, let's pretend to go to sleep again. Ready? I was laying in my sleeping bag. I couldn't go to sleep. I looked at my watch and I wanted to weep. I rolled to my left, I rolled to my right, but all I could hear were animal noises in the night. I heard a peep, 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 peep. What animal did I hear? Peep, 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 peep. A frog. This frog is called a spring peeper. It makes a noise like peep, peep, peep. Can you peep peep like a spring peeper? Peep, 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 peep. Great job. Okay, we're gonna pretend to go to sleep one more time. Ready? I was laying in my sleeping bag. I couldn't go to sleep. I looked at my watch and I wanted to weep. I rolled to my left, I rolled to my right, but all I could hear were animal noises in the night. I heard a chip, 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 chip. What animal did I hear? Chip, chip. A cricket. Did you guess cricket? Good job. 
Can you chirp like a cricket? Chirp, chirp. Great job, great job making animal noises. Now, how many animals did we hear last night? Let's count. One, two, three, four. Four animals. Great counting, everybody. Now, we're gonna sing one more song before story time is over. And in this song, we're gonna pretend like we're cooking different foods over the campfire. So, pretend like you have a fire. I'm gonna use this pretend fire that I made. But you can just pretend like there's a fire in the middle of the room. All right, now this song is pretty popular, it's pretty famous. If you can guess the words, you should sing along with me. If not, just pretend like you're holding a stick and you're gonna cook something over the fire. All right, ready? You put your hot dog in, you put your hot dog out, you put your hot dog in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your kebab in, you put your kebab out, you put your kebab in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. You put your marshmallow in, you put your marshmallow out, you put your marshmallow in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about for the vegans. You put your potato in, you put your potato out, you put your potato in and you shake it all about. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. Great job, everybody. That food was so delicious, I wanna eat some. Can you pretend to eat some off of your camping stick? Don't eat it when it's too hot, you can burn your mouth. Ouch. All right, so normally during story time, I would read the story right now. And the story that I would read to you today is Curious George Goes Camping by H.A. Ray. But since we're on video, I can't read this story to you today. But if you have a book about camping or even just about exploring the outdoors, you should read that together with your child today. And if everybody was here, Today, I would have a tent pitched outside of the nature center and the kids would be able to crawl in and out of it. Uh, that obviously isn't a great activity to do in a public place during these times of social distancing, but you can pretend to pitch a tent at home. If you have a tent, you could pitch it in your yard or even inside your house. If you don't have a tent, you could try to build a fort inside your house and pretend like you're camping outside. If you're in an apartment and you don't have access to a yard, building a fort inside is a great thing to do with your kids. You can make a pretend fire like this one out of felt and out of uh, paper towel construction uh, cardboard rolls. And then you can even glue a cotton ball to the end of a stick and pretend to roast it. Since we can't have open fires in New York City or outdoor fires in New York City, one way that you can roast a marshmallow is in a toaster oven. You could put it on a baking sheet and then use the toaster oven to melt the marshmallow, or you could put a marshmallow in the oven and you can make s'mores. You could also just make s'mores out of raw marshmallows. You don't have to melt them and cook them. But these are all some fun and great activities that you can do to pretend to go camping. If you can go camping, you can look at the New York State Parks website to find which places where you can take your family camping. New York State Parks puts out camping guides just like this one that show all the campgrounds at New York State Parks throughout New York State. You can visit our website at parks.ny.gov to find a list of campgrounds that you can visit. You can visit our Facebook page all week to find tips about camping and tips about being environmentally friendly while you're camping. And then at the end of the week, we're gonna share a list of campgrounds that are our staff's favorite campgrounds to camp in. Okay, are you ready to sing the goodbye song? 
We clap to say goodbye. We clap to say goodbye. With our friends at story time, we clap to say goodbye. We wave to say goodbye. We wave to say goodbye. With our friends at story time, we wave to say goodbye. We stomp to say goodbye. We stomp to say goodbye. With our friends at story time, we stomp to say goodbye. Great job, everybody. I'll see you next week.